I'm so tired of these late night talks Saying things that we don't mean That we regret in the morning Yeah I just wish we could open up Be a little more honest This is getting exhausting Yeah Can't do one more night of having to sleep on the sofa I just wanna figure it out now before it's over I don't wanna pack my things and be ready to let you go to let you go But maybe it's too late To figure it out To make it through Maybe it can't wait Maybe it's time Maybe we don't I try to pull you closer Cause I don't wanna go yet. But maybe it's too late To figure it out To make it through Maybe it's too late Maybe it's too late oh. Try to pull you closer Cause I don't You can go like on the same pole. It's <laughs> <laughs> like facing each other. You can count it. We've done like 10 and he's like I know. six. Because she was three. ahead of you. <laughs> All right, you got that. Now just do the 20 knees out and you. It is now. Five, <laughs> Alrighty guys, so I'm home now. I hope you guys enjoyed those little snippets of my training session with Joe at Never Quit Fit, um, which is in bundle. I honestly had such a good session. I never really trained with PTs apart from like when I train with them. And uh, yeah, it was actually a really good session. He definitely pushed Ali and I, so it was really, really good. I really liked like the vibe of the place as well. It was really nice and like chill and yeah, it was really fun. I think I'm going to start going there once a week for like a month and just see how I go. But yeah, it was actually really, really good. It's actually currently midday now and I've just been at home cleaning. I've been doing some work on my laptop, um, but I'm just about to have a shower because I look like an actual hot mess. And get ready for the day. I've actually got to film the intro for one of my last vlogs, my birthday vlog actually. So that's going up on Thursday. So you guys aren't going to see this video for a couple weeks from now, like when I'm filming this. I just have so many vlogs that are yet to go up. I have one more after my birthday vlog and then this one. So that's why everything's a little bit all over the place. But yeah, I'm just gonna have a quick shower now and just kind of freshen up a bit. I feel so gross right now. And then this afternoon I've got um, my cleaner coming and then I've also got to go food shopping as well. So I'll obviously give you guys a little food shopping haul or groceries haul as well because I know you guys love that. But I'm feeling like really good with my training at the moment. I feel like I kind of slacked off a bit for about a month there, like a couple months ago. And like I'm really back into a routine now. Um, just... I, I just feel like with moving and stuff, it's really hard to like keep on track with the gym because you've just got so many things going on. But I've really like settled into my place now and like I feel like I've got a good routine going. So I'm really happy about that. But yeah, I'll see you guys probably later on. I really need to get my car washed, but I think I'm going to have to go tomorrow because um, I suck and I don't have time to go today. Alrighty guys, so I'm just in my bathroom at the moment. Um, by the way, if you guys can see that mark on my robe, I was drinking a protein shake just before and I kind of missed my mouth a little bit. But I thought I'd share with you guys, um, there's a brand called Native actually sent me um, a couple of their deodorants the other week to try out. They sent me three actually, I'll get the other two out. They sent me the coconut and vanilla one, the lavender and rose, and the sweet peach and nectar. Um, the one I'm currently using at the moment is the coconut and vanilla one. And these are paraben and aluminium free, which is amazing. I'd say my favorite scent probably... Ooh, probably is the sweet peach and nectar one but since we are in winter at the moment still i have been using the coconut and vanilla one recently and then i'll switch over to the sweet peach and nectar um once we do go into the hotter months because i personally love like sweeter more vanilla kind of chocolatey scents um in the colder months but yeah i've been absolutely loving um these deodorants so far they're like a um you guys can see here it's not like that wet kind of deodorant i don't know what you call it it's kind of like that lotiony type 
vibe where it doesn't leave your underarms wet whatsoever perfect for summer you obviously don't want to have like wet greasy sticky underarms in summer that's like the worst thing ever and this deodorant does not do that at all and the scent's just like super light and fresh like it just smells so good it doesn't smell like you have deodorant on if that makes sense it just makes your underarms smell really really nice and it also doesn't leave like a white cast under your arms as well which i love i actually always struggle with that with other deodorants even like the um dryer like what do you what do you call i don't even know what like you'd call this type of deodorant the ones that aren't like greasy but um yeah usually they will like leave like white marks under my underarms and this one doesn't at all so yeah i've been really loving these deodorants so far i can't wait to use the other two as well the lavender and rose one smells amazing also they have also kindly given me a discount code as well which i will leave on the screen as well as down below so i think it's three deodorants are usually like 36 dollars or something like that but with my code you do get 33% off and as well as that my code will also give you guys 20% off any body washes or toothpaste as well which is amazing so I just got back from the shops I thought I'd show you guys what I got I actually went to there's like one of those fruit markets right next to the coals that I go to so I got all my fruits from there I'll start off with that so I got some spinach some other salad like the leafy salad mix with all that um, i got two pineapples for three dollars bargain got a whole tub of cherry tomatoes that was like a dollar 70 or something avocados apples capsicum onion lemon cucumber and then i also actually just got some miso soup from there as well because i had pass it and i figured i'd grab it and then from coles i picked up this from you foods actually chili con carne um this is just for lunch during the week if i can't be bothered cooking or maybe dinner one night some low carb high protein fiber wraps because i'm gonna make some locale pizzas for dinner tonight some lactose free cheese for my pizza as well coke zero i always have coke zero in the house because i usually will have it for dinner not for dinner <laughs> alongside my dinner you know what i mean um, and then i got a couple of bags of chips as well so i got these ones here which are veggie straws and then the sour cream and herb flavor and then i got these smith's oven baked sour cream and chives chips but some tomato paste for my pizzas i got some free range chicken this i'm going to put in my salads for the next couple of days and then also on the locale pizza that i'm going to make for dinner tonight which I'll show you guys how I make actually this is really good timing and then I also just got some bread this is the bread that I like to get it's the country split wholemeal bread and the macros on this is pretty good so that's the bread that I get and then I just keep it in the freezer so that it doesn't go to waste I don't really eat bread that much but I'll have it as toast with um some avocado and eggs and that's like one of my favorite lunches ever or breakfast and then i also got some berries mixed berries from this brand and then also some mangoes from the same brand because they do the best i feel like the fruits from this brand just taste way better the creative gourmet brand and then i also got a couple of things of ice cream so i got boysenberry drumsticks and caramel ice cream because i love caramel and then i just got some more almond milk um and then i also stopped over i got some gluten-free donuts they always give me a free one as well i'm like you guys are trying to make me fat i swear oh yeah i actually also got this from cold today it's just like a dish brush but i thought it was cute so i got that also i got my freaking car clean and literally it started raining as soon as i drove out of the shop so Love that for me. But I just got my house cleaned as well by Fresh Breeze Cleaning. As per usual, I'm still using them as my cleaners um, for this place because they are amazing. But my house looks so nice and clean. The floors look perfect again. Yeah, I'll give you guys a quick look around at my house. It literally looks so nice and clean now. Let's see what's happening in my bathroom. Look at how magnificent it looks in here. So I really need to keep on top of like cleaning my floors or vacuuming them. I need to get a new vacuum actually. I really want to get the Dyson because my vacuum at the moment sucks. But yeah, there's my little apartment tour. Come on, Bowie. Anyways, I'm gonna put all this away now and then I'll probably just see you guys when I make dinner. So I'll see you guys soon. Also, I literally filled up this jar with Oreos what, last week, week and a half ago and half gone. I'm an animal, honestly. <laughs> I literally have pins and needles on my feet right now. Um, but yeah, as I was saying before, 
Um, I'm gonna be making some locale pizzas for dinner. Let me just get all the ingredients out that I'm gonna be using for today. Just so I can let you guys know. You can obviously use whatever you want as well. Like you can literally put whatever toppings you want. I'm just gonna be um, shredding up some chicken. Um, you guys can get like the chicken that's already shredded or you can like boil your own chicken and also some spinach, which I just put on top. Some shredded cheese. This is just some lactose free shredded cheese. Also gonna chuck some tomato pesto on top, just like do little droplets. Some avocado, I don't really usually love avocado, but what I think I might do is I might like cube it up because I don't like big pieces of avocado. Onion, red onion. Some capsicum as well, just for some extra veggies. Um, tomato paste, I just use like one of these and that's enough, which is two tablespoons. Um, and then as I showed you guys before, I got these low carb and high protein plus fiber wraps, which this actually only has 172 calories her serve which is obviously better than like having a normal bread base one of my followers actually sent me a base um that's like high protein and pretty good macros i couldn't remember which it was though but i'll definitely get that next time then also just some barbecue sauce and some aioli i'm also going to chuck some chili flakes on top as well so i think what i'm going to do first is i'm going to shred up my chicken I don't know why it's so damn hard Being there for each other and Showing you my true colors Yeah I don't know why it's difficult I'm trying to make amends But it doesn't seem to help No Can't do one more night of heaven To sleep on the sofa I just wanna figure it out now Before it's over I don't wanna pack my things And be ready to let you go To let you Maybe it's too late to figure it out to make it through. Maybe it can't wait, maybe it's time, maybe we're through. I try to pull you closer, cause I don't wanna go yet. But maybe it's too late to figure it out to make it through. Maybe it's too late. Maybe it's too late. Oh. Try to pull you closer, cause I don't wanna go yet. That is my pizza. This will go in the oven now for like five minutes. It doesn't need long at all, um, but I do like to crisp up the base because I like a crispy base. I actually have issues, guys. I literally only just realized that I didn't film the after when I took it out of the oven, but I took a photo. Um, for my Instagram story, so I'll insert it now, but oh my god, that was so good. I couldn't even finish all of it, which means that I put a lot of toppings on probably because usually I can like finish it all in two seconds. But I have also eaten a lot of food today, so could potentially be why also, but yeah, that was so delicious. Definitely a really good meal idea, especially for like weeknights when you want something quick, but still get like your veggies in and all that kind of thing, so super yummy good morning guys so it is the next day now um it's actually 11 30 in the morning i literally just got out of bed i've been doing work in bed all morning which is fine but i literally could not move i am so sore right now i feel a little bit better now that i'm like walking around but i'm literally walking like i'm not even gonna say it. i am literally on struggle street right now um, but I'm just gonna, I guess, start off my day. Well, I have started off my day because I've been doing work in bed. Um, I finished editing my birthday vlog and also I've just been doing some emails and stuff. But I'm just gonna clean up a little bit around my house. I'm gonna sit down and write everything else that I need to get done for the day. Look at me in the background of my little robe on. Um, and then this afternoon, I've got a facial at one. I wanna figure it out now before it's over. I don't wanna pack my things and be ready to let you go. To let you go. But maybe it's too late to figure it out to make it through. Maybe it can wait. Maybe it's time. Maybe we do. Guys, it's literally... Pissing down rain outside, lovely. How am I gonna fucking do this? Pull you closer, 
to leave for my facial I thought I'd show you guys what I'm wearing real quick um, this little crop that I'm wearing is actually from a shop called cheap it's like C-H-E-E-P I got it so long ago um, at Rubina so and so that's wrong it's actually really cute my joggers are from Meshki and then shoes are just these Air Forces which I got custom made I'm just wearing my YSL wallet on chain which I turn into a shoulder bag because I like the look of it but that's what I'm wearing today. I'm actually really full from my coffee and my fruit. I don't know why, but I'm so full right now. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys when I get there. All of those years that passed us by All of those tears we both have cried I really miss to seeing you smile I blame myself although I tried although I tried I tried alrighty guys so we did the skin needling this is how my skin looks straight after so it is a little bit red not too bad because we didn't go super deep um, but it is still a little bit red like that um scarring or discoloration that i have there is quite red but i'm excited to see how my skin reacts to skin needling as i said we didn't go super deep this first time a because i have an event on this weekend and b because i just want to see how my skin reacts first but i'm excited to um actually see what it does for my skin because there's a lot of benefits to skin needling so yeah, I just can't touch my face. I can't wash it tonight, which will be hard. And it's hard at the moment because we're meant to be wearing masks, but yeah, I don't want to put any bacteria on my face. So I'm just going to have to, I was going to go to Ferry Road after this, but I'm not going to be able to do that because I don't want to put bacteria on my face um, by putting a mask on. So yeah. It's been a couple hours now. It's currently 4.15 and my skin is literally like back to normal. It's not even red anymore at all. Um, I just wanted to show you guys what I got from StockX. I'm just going to sit up like this because I see we are crunching down. So I picked up these Essentials joggers right here. So the shade of them is taupe um, and they retail for $90 and I paid like $250 for them, $300 maybe. I got these in a size extra small. It is men's sizing. They are really nice. I thought the color was gonna be a bit different, but I do actually quite like it because I don't really have anything this color, like in terms of trackies. It has a little Essentials logo on the front. It also says Essentials on the leg over here. And then there's also a pocket in the back. They're really nice quality and the inside's really nice too. I might have to get more colors because I'm actually Pleasantly surprised. I also have this little baby parcel here from Perla. Also, my machine in the background is doing the most right now. But I saw a couple of people post about um, this brand and she reached out to me. Oh my god. I... Oh my god. This is why you don't use scissors to open stuff because I literally just cut off one little bit of the letter or the little message. But she said, Dear Tasha, words cannot express how insanely grateful I am for your support. From our short chat, I can already tell you have such a beautiful soul. I started this business when I was 17 and to think that in under a year, I would have the opportunity to work with you is insane. Oh, I hope you like the pieces in your first package and I can't wait to see you wearing them. All my love, Perla. P.S. Prob's a bit TMI, but you literally convinced me to get my boobs done on one cosmetics. Hehe, <laughs> I just had to tell you. Oh, what a cutie. I didn't realize she was so young. That's crazy. So she's only 18 and she has created this amazing business for herself. She sent me this really pretty Dior necklace right here, which I'll definitely be wearing for content day tomorrow. And then she also sent me a couple of little bracelets as well. So she sent me this... CD one, Chanel, and then two kind of like Diamante ones. And what's really cool about these is you can actually adjust 
how tight you want the bracelet, which is perfect for someone like me because I literally have little baby wrists. Like my wrists and my fingers are so tiny. You guys probably can't tell on camera, but every time people see me in real life, they literally like freak out because my um, wrists and my fingers are so ridiculously small. But yeah, I can't wait to wear these. I'm honestly so stoked. And that note was so cute. So thank you so much. Good morning, guys. So um, it is still a little bit dark um, in my place at the moment because it is only 6.30 in the morning. But I just wanted to show you guys my skin. I literally looked in the mirror this morning and I was like, holy shit, my skin looks so good. So, so far, I'm loving the results of the skin needling, but I'll obviously keep you guys updated as the days go on. And we also didn't go like really deep into the collagen layer of my skin, as I've said like 500 times. We just did um, it really light this time just to see how my skin would react. And so we could like slowly, you know, what's the word? You know what I mean? Um, anyways, I'm about to head over to the gym right now. I'm not going to bring my camera, but I will film the workouts on my phone so i'll just insert them they might be like that way but i don't think you guys really care i'll show you guys what i'm wearing real quick though oh my god no battery shit shit so this jacket that i'm wearing is from sassy collection so are my shorts this top that i'm wearing is from lana jane i got it so long ago though so might not be available anymore. And then my shoes are just from Nike. I got them, I think in America, but I really love them with like colorful tops like this. I feel like it matches so well. got back from the gym i actually stopped by sephora on the way back and i also actually got my nails um redone because i just didn't like how the um guy that did them the other day like did them so i don't know i just got them to redo it and they look so much better now and i also had two that snapped off and i was like i just can't have that shit happening this weekend i literally was like not gonna get them redone but i'm like if i'm going out this weekend they need to look decent but yeah i stopped by sephora on the way back to my car and i got a couple things so i got the laneige um lip glowy balm i wanted the gummy bear one but it was all sold out um so i just got this one and i actually have this in the pot version um i didn't know they came in the lip balm like proper packaging so that's super exciting um i might actually have to get a couple of these because this is like my favorite lip balm ever and then I also picked up something from Hiram's skincare line. I'm actually going to look into more of this stuff. Um, but I heard good things about this on TikTok. It's a niacinamide and mar maracuja daily barrier support moisturizer. So this one was like one of the more expensive things in his line. Um, it doesn't really come with that much. And I wish that the packaging was different. Like I'd rather it if it was in a pot. But I'm intrigued to see how this actually works for my skin and whether I like it or not. Also, um, Rare Beauty is actually at Sephora now. So I wanted to pick up something. Didn't really need a new concealer. Didn't really need a new um, foundation. And I didn't really like a lip product. So I got this liquid blush, which is in the shade Love. Just like a matte blush. I will try this out today, if I remember. And let you guys know. I'm going to just make a coffee real quick. Um, Maya just got here. I just buzzed her up. Um... And then I'm going to get ready for content. I don't actually have that much content to do today. I think I'm actually just going to get like two photos and then maybe like a selfie. And then I'm just going to get um, Maya to like help me with a couple of other jobs. And then this afternoon I'm getting my teeth done or my composite bonding done, which is super exciting. So yeah, I can't wait to take you guys to that and see how it looks. I'm make myself a coffee real quick because... Um, like something i had a krispy kreme donut before i just can't help myself can i but yeah, i had a krispy kreme donut before and look she was really good but don't know if it was worth 
200 cows. <laughs> that's the thing about eating like high cal foods or like food that's not good for you and high in sugar and stuff. It's like, it's not actually going to fill you up. Like I'm hungry now, but I'm on a deficit. So I'm like, I'm not going to have more food until probably like two. So I've pretty much sabotaged my breakfast, my breakfast, my breakfast for that dumb donut. That wasn't even worth it. Yeah, I actually had like a lot of things I needed to do this morning, but that's just going to have to wait till tonight. I have like heaps of bills to pay. So I'm just going to have to do that either tonight when I get home or in the morning. And I can't forget about it because I don't like being late. I'm just going to have this coffee, have a shower, get ready, and I'll see you guys when I'm ready for the day. So guys, I'm all ready now. My hair looks so much darker because I put heaps of oil in it. We did get the first round of photos for lounge outside. That was super quick and easy. Um, but I'm gonna head down to a restaurant near me um, and get this second photo. And then that's all the content that I need to get done for the day. I actually have so much work that I have to do and like a lot of content that I have to take, but I don't have any packages here with me. So it's like, I hate being behind on stuff, but it's also not really my fault, is it? Um, but I'll show you guys what I'm wearing. It's from White Fox. Um, so the top, top's White Fox, jeans are White Fox, shoes are from Pretty Little Thing. And then this necklace is from um, Perla, the label, P-E-U-R-L-A. And then my earrings are from PLT as well. And then I'm just wearing my black Jacquemus bag, which is over there. So, oh boy. She was so sad. She knows I'm leaving. It's all right. We'll only be gone for an hour. I miss. She's like, I hate you. Let's go. Oh yeah. Also, I've got a package here from Crop Shop, which I'll show you guys later on. Because um, my friend Sophia gave it to me today. She like works for um, Rachel, the owner. So she just gave it to me. Guys, nice. these are the best travel fries in the world. <laughs> this is the name of the restaurant. Free promo, thank you. Free promo, because <laughs> I always take photos morning guys so it is actually the next day now um the last i think the last thing i showed you guys was me at the dentist and we actually ended up um so i'll completely show you guys my teeth um i like smile so i wanted him to fill in just like this little triangle here and see how it looked with the composite bonding and when i um looked at it because he said that it probably wasn't going to end up looking that good unless I like filled in these little triangles here too. Um, and then, yeah, we like ended up doing it. I looked in the mirror and I decided that I actually didn't like it. We didn't actually end up doing any composite bonding because he didn't think that I needed it. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I just like don't really like the big gap there. And what he ended up doing was he just like kind of shaved off where I had like little chips and stuff and he like just kind of polish everything off and my teeth are looking so good let me take this off it's actually getting a bit hot in here but yeah i'm actually really happy with how my teeth look overall um, i'm still gonna decide maybe i might like fill in the gaps and then do the other tooth as well but that'll kind of that'll kind of give me more of like a hollywood look so um yeah i'll just decide over the next few months like i think my teeth look really good right now um i don't want to like rush into anything but um, anyways, I wanted to show you guys um, a couple of packages that I got yesterday. So there's one here from Crop Shop Boutique, which I actually bought all of this stuff myself. I got a couple of things. I'm not sure what the collection's called, but I'm always on the lookout for like a nice pair of black leggings and black sports bras. Whites as well. I love whites, but brands don't really come out with whites that often when it comes to like 
gym clothes. Um, but I'll quickly just show you guys these pieces. Also, if anyone's wondering, this top that I'm wearing, this bodysuit from Skims. I've got these leggings right here. I hope these are full length. So it's from the Bear Collection, their scrunch bum, and then also it's like a V-front. You guys can't really tell, but this is how the material looks. I actually think I might wear this to the gym tomorrow and see how that performs when I train lower. And then I also picked up the shorts, which is just the same deal again, like the V-front scrunch bum, and it's the same material. I picked up everything in a size small. And then I also picked up this top right here in a size extra small. And it's just like a scoop neck top at the back crisscrosses like that so i thought this was really cute and yeah i got that in an extra small because i like my tops to be nice and little and then i actually have a package here from bombshell and i bought all of this stuff myself as well i literally spent like 600 dollars or something i think i was just like looking at my wardrobe the other day and i was like i really need more leggings specifically like black leggings um but i picked up these leggings right here which again have the v front and then there's also pockets on the side and then the back's like a scrunch bum. And then I picked up this top right here, which is just like a V-neck front top. And there's like a bit of cinching. And then the back's like fully open. So you obviously have to wear a sports bra under this. I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to, but I personally would. I got these gray ones right here. I thought they were really cute. And I also got this purple pair of leggings because I don't have any purple leggings. But yeah, I thought I'd just show you guys all that stuff really quickly. I actually have to head over to um, the security office of my old place because they called me yesterday and they said I have a few packages there. So I'm going to go pick that up now and then I'm just going to come home and chill. I have dinner tonight at six o'clock. Me and my friend Kiana are going to Moomoo's in Broadbeach, which I've never actually been there before, which is surprising considering I've lived on the Gold Coast for so long. I tend to be one of those people who like will just go to the same restaurants and like kind of rotate everything. But my goal for like this year, this is like the weirdest goal. It's not really a goal. It's just like something I want to do. Um, I definitely want to like try out new restaurants. There's so many nice restaurants on the Gold Coast that I haven't tried before. And now that I like live in the middle of everything and I'm like in amongst all of it, um, I really want to make an effort to, yeah, just try out all the different places. I want to go to like Kiyomi as well. I've never actually been to Kiyomi before. Um, and then there's like light years and like all these joints in Burley and down that way that I haven't been to. As we get older, Maybe we change. I had my reasons. I couldn't stay. Hope you're okay now. Even if I love you, love you. I hope you guys enjoyed those little gym clips. I had such a good session this morning. Um, I actually did a workout from mine and Emily's gym program. So I'll leave that down below for you guys so you guys um, can check it out if you guys want to. Honestly, the workouts are so like, they're actually pretty difficult, not gonna lie. Definitely push you, so. Yeah, I got a really good workout in this morning. Um, we're also offering, um, oh, let me just hold on to this. Uh, we're also actually offering Afterpay now as well, so you guys can put all your programs on Afterpay if you would like to. Um, so yeah, definitely check it out. I'm on my way to uh, the shops now because I want to try and find like a cute anklet to wear with my outfit tonight. And then I also need to get double-sided tape because my boobs are going to be out otherwise. I just went and popped over to the shops and picked up a couple of things quickly. Got some... Um, what is this double-sided tape for my outfit because it's a little bit um I wore it on New Year's in black and it was kind of like sliding around a bit so I just wanted to get some tape for tonight also got some breast lift tape I actually have heaps of that at home so I don't even know why I bought that whatever so yeah those two are from bras and things and then I also got these undies as well from bras and things because I thought they looked so comfy I like the color as well like I don't have anything like this it's like a oak mealy kind of grainy fabric then i popped into la visa and picked up a couple things as well i might not be wearing all of this with my outfit tonight but i just got a few things just to have options so i got this necklace which has like a long little bit at the front as well i thought that was really cute and then i got these earrings 
I don't have big thick hoops like this, so I actually do need these even if I don't wear them. And then I got this gold plated bracelet here, but I'm going to use it as an anklet potentially. And then I also got this bracelet here, which I could also potentially use as an anklet for my outfit. Sorry, I'm like waving it around, but yeah, it's just like a chain kind of bracelet. I'm actually sitting at my friend Izzy's house right now because she's actually going to do my hair for me. So I'm going to head up there now. Lunch is at 2.30. It's currently 10.30. So yeah, I'm going to head up there now, get my hair done by Izzy. I'm going to do mermaid waves, um, go home, have a shower, and then get ready for tonight. I'm so excited to see all the girls. And yeah, it's just gonna be a good time, you know? I'm keen to have some lunch as well at Jimmy Wah's because it is actually a really good restaurant. So yeah, I'll see you guys later on. Alrighty guys, so Izzy's here with me. Um, I ended up going to her place and we were just like, you know what, I need to have a shower. Um, so let's just do my hair at mine. I've just quickly chucked on my Elias skin mask because I love putting this on like before I go out I just feel like it like really tightens up my pores made myself a coffee I'm gonna take this off now though and we're gonna start on my hair I feel like I probably should have left it on a little bit longer but that's fine I'm a bit on edge right now what's the time um, it's okay that's perfect so I've got two hours to get ready something It is actually a couple weeks later now. I um, didn't actually vlog anything after Izzy did my hair. I was literally running so late to my own event or my own lunch. I I ended up getting there like 30, 35 minutes late, I think. So I was really just like rushing after she did my hair to do my makeup and to like finish getting ready. But honestly, I had such a good night. I didn't get home till like three in the morning or something ridiculous like that which i never stay out that late and we also started at like 2 p.m well i got there at like 2 30. we started so early as well so i'm actually shocked that i was out that late but it was a really really good night i literally woke up in my sleep and vomited all over myself so that's how my night ended but a lot of you guys were actually asking on my instagram about my outfit um i'll insert a photo of it on the screen because it was actually really cute but the dress was from Chandel the label i did tag that but a lot of people were asking about my shoes even in my stories and they are from Bottega Veneta and yeah my jewelry you guys are seeing that was from Levi's so like my anklet and stuff well my it's like a bracelet but i wore it as an anklet as i told you guys but anyways i am just gonna close out the vlog here it's been another long one i know you guys love my long vlogs but i hope you guys have enjoyed watching and i'll see you all in my next one bye